Hello friends, so glad to have you um, listen to this devotional. We're talking about overcoming, being victorious as we live our Christian lives. And today I want to read for us from 1 John chapter 5 verses 4 and 5. For whatever is born of God overcomes the world, and this is the victory that has overcome the world, our faith. Who is he who overcomes the world but he who believes that Jesus is the Son of God. So we are told here that we who are born of God, we are able to overcome the world. What does the term world refer to? The, world, the term world uh, encompasses sin, it encompasses the influences of the, of, um, the environment around us. Uh, it also refers to rebellion that we see around us. So, world is representative of all that. Now, John in his epistles also pointed out that there are the attractions uh, of the world that try to distract us and draw us away from God, uh, which would be the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life. So, all of these things cannot take us away from the purpose of God for our lives. So, it's a, it's a great and a greatly encouraging thought that we will not be shaken. No matter what tries to take us off track, we will stand firm and steadfast in what God has called us to do. So, friends, just want to um, encourage us that, you know, God has given us this great promise of stability and said that we who are born of God that we will overcome the world. You know, in the world, we also have um, uh, the spirit of the Antichrist. We have the spirit of deception. We have the spirit of error, as John points out in his epistle. Um, but despite all this, you know, we can run the race and we can finish the race strong. Uh, and in this passage, I want to bring our attention to an overcoming aspect. So at the end of verse 4, it says, overcome the world, our faith. So we are to depend on our faith to overcome. You now all the things that I just listed out, faith is what causes us to overcome. Faith is what causes us to stay anchored in God. Just think about Abraham. Abraham is a wonderful example of faith. He stood on the promise of God. For, um, for a very long time. And when he stood in faith, the promises came through for him. And similarly, friends, for us to overcome, uh, there can be many things that come our way to shake us all up. Uh, but, you know, like Abraham, can we be firm? Can we stay strong in what God has spoken and his promises? When we do that, we will see that we are taking an overcoming step, uh, one overcoming step after another. Uh, and I pray, you know, that uh, this would also be your journey. Let's pray together. Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word. We thank you for the examples in your word, O oh God. And we pray that we will be people of faith. And through faith, Lord, cause us to overcome, Lord, anything that the um, enemy is hurling at us, Father God. And Lord, we, we declare that we are overcomers. We declare that greater is he who is in us than he who is in the world. And we give you all the glory. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.